I love Scooby. I love the Scooby Doo franchise. I was a big fan. Now we watched Saturday morning cartoons. There were six kids, so we sat around and watched them together, which was always fun. The thing I love the most about Scooby and Shaggy, I, the things I still love about Scooby and Shaggy, is that their love for each other is really contagious. And so you appreciate their antics as seen through their eyes looking at each other. And that's something we tried to capture with this movie. I love the idea of taking Scooby and Shaggy and the gang and putting them in the cinematic universe of other Hanna-Barbera characters. I think it's fun to see them interact and fun to see them play off of each other, both on a visual level, because these characters weren't designed to necessarily look um, like they belong in the same world, so that's been fun to try to pull off. And I think it's really fun to see them on a story level where you put, you put Velma into a mystery that is, has real stakes. These aren't fake ghosts. These are real stakes that have to be solved. And throwing them into that universe where you have Captain Caveman and Blue Falcon and Dynamite and Dee Dee sort of changes the stakes and it makes it fun to watch. Tony has spent his entire career at Warner Brothers and working inside of the Hanna-Barbera and Looney Tunes universe. And so Tony brings this knowledge that translates into passion, that translates into humor, and translates into really understanding the characters. He's a passionate, talented man, and he's done a lot of facets of the animation process and his 25 plus year career, I think. And I love watching him in front of the animators because he would, he would act out the scenes and so you could see him really get inside the character's head. So he's acting out the scene to the animators who are really the actors of the scene and their interaction together has, has um, ended up in really great animation. 